Today I'm going to be giving you guys a tour of my rebuild of Grand Oak Stables. If you guys want to see the original creator's video, it's linked in the description box. Just a disclaimer, I rebuilt someone else's build and that is from a YouTube video. This is not my original idea. Now that that's out there, I'll show you guys my rebuild of the stables. Um. I originally was building this with Cece like last year and she spawned like a million horses. So this is the entrance to Grand Oak Stables remake. I like remade the overall layout of the plot. I called it Palm Beach Stables because I added my own texture pack and used my own textures. And I play on a Mac, so it's honestly super laggy with like filming. So I'm gonna turn my shaders off. For filming purposes, that will be so much better, but just know it looks way better with shaders on. <laughs> but yeah, I play on a Mac and I can't film and play with shaders on Minecraft because that's just not how this world works. Okay, so first I'll show you guys the pastures, literally the same. I literally tried to like make it the exact same as her video. Yeah, and originally I was making this, it was on a server I had with CC and we were just remaking it and then we didn't touch it for a while like a year and i suddenly just wanted to make more minecraft videos on my channel and i think milky is in the pasture yeah milky is in the pasture love that for him okay let's go inside the barn i tried literally to recreate it like as closely as i could as possible but with my own textures and like updated because that was an old video so i use this like nice wood i made my own texture pack for this I just put some pictures of horses and like some greenery. There's a view of Cece's ghost house that she never finished. And this is the Palm Beach stables. It has like information cards and like packets and e chart and stuff like that. These are some IRL pictures of horses and me riding horses. <laughs> Um, these are the tack up stalls. I use, I will link the CIT packs I use in the description box too. So these are just like basic pack chests with like brushes and eye spray, shampoo, puff oil, puff picks, cleaning supplies so you can clean up after yourself and a water facet because you never know. And this stool is like for if you need a leg up or something. And then there's another stall on this side. It has some pictures. This is a washing station. It's not a stall. And it has another faucet and literally like the same and if you got this ladder and this is the hayloft so it looks like this all the hay and you can see out the front and then just like in her build this was difficult I, the reason i'm posting this even is because i made this like a year and a half ago i want to say and then we did it on a server and i just finished it like this week because i was like that took so much work and if in case it gets erased i just i just want to have this somewhere this is where people can watch lessons or competitions there's like couches and stuff and then there's not much else this is where all the stalls are this is the only side that has actual horses in it this is milky's stall and there's like a bridle it says he's out to pasture like the ceiling and a salt lick and some low cal balancer and there's some food in there and some water i these doors took a long time these stall doors to pick like i had to make them but it took a lot of work Okay, and this is Philippa's stall. Philippa's not happy to be here right now. And I literally just put like the feed that they take and just all of the things. I don't know. Do I have any more horses? Oh, Snickerdoodle's having fun right now. I got like a horse texture pack, obviously, because the horses are prettier this way. You guys have good horse texture packs you like. Hit me up. Then we have Luna. Luna's so pretty. Luna uses an alfalfa blend. I think Milky is the senior. No, Philippa is my senior. Philippa eats senior mix. And then the rest of the stalls are honestly empty. And if you go out this way, you can go out to where like the washing stations are, but we'll get there later. And like I said, I saved this. Like this was a server I had with Stacey and then I just saved it so that I could edit it because the server had run out or something. I don't know. It was complicated. She had a horse named Dipper and I gave Dipper some alfalfa blend because he's just in here chilling and sad because CC doesn't love him anymore. <laughs> um, and I put all these things in his tack box because it was empty, to be honest with you. And the other side is literally the same. Like, it's just stalls. And if you want to see that again, you can watch her video. But I want to rebuild some nostalgic equestrian Minecraft videos, so comment ones you want me to do next because I really like, I like rebuilding stuff that other people built because I'm a hacker. Okay, so these are all the saddles are kept and the bridles are up here and then helmets. You can get all the different kinds of feed with your buckets and then extra hay nets 
and feed and stuff for your horses, you know. I made these hay nets in my texture pack, but they look so ugly on the wall. They literally look so ugly. So I just use these ones in the horses stalls and we pretend they're the same. I just used those for the pictures because they look pretty. Yeah, if you go in, these are the private lockers and I have some photos. This is Cece's locker. You can look in here, I guess. It's empty. It was probably full, but I think some things didn't make the transfer between the server and me downloading the world. So there's that. These are all my like worst items, like boots, lead, a saddle, and then like a blanket, saddle pad, and a horseshoe. And then these are like grooming kit. And then this is like my, my riding stuff. So yeah, here is like name tags and an anvil so I can name my horses. And honestly, I didn't know what to do with these up here. I put extra name tags, golden apples, for like breeding and stuff. And then honestly, I forgot to get rid of these. That was another thing that didn't transfer well. <laughs> Um, yeah, so if you guys have any ideas about what you want me to put in these boxes, let me know. And let's go to the other side. This is like the offices, just like literally the same as her video. So I have like ribbons that are way bigger than even my character. For reference, I'm pretty sure the blue one is bigger than me, but it's fine. Okay, these are just viewing areas for people to watch. And then this is like an office. It has like papers and a TV that doesn't work love that and then this is like a private viewing box and then it has like a i just put like a radio in here so that they could hear if the announcer was saying i tried to find like horse crossing signs like what she had in her video and then this is the like riding arena i literally copied one of like she had multiple videos of this and i just copied the same formation she had in her video there's a hole in the ground um in order to make it light in here i used glowstone i like textured it to make it look like sand but that way it's like brighter in here and not so dark we'll come in here later i'll ride a horse in here sorry it does not look as good with sh without shaders on but you guys saw what it looked like at first the shaders make it look way better then just like in her video i've made trailers obviously they're a little bit different they're two-door trailers and you can like let your horse in with this hay bales and this just like locks them in place in her video there was like a house but i did a completely different house i think that i used build to make this house so i'll link that in the description box um and i haven't finished it honestly i started building the wall and i still have to finish it but here's what it looks like i used a ton of cit packs it's just like it's this cute like farmhouse i left an anvil here it's fine and it was like fall time when i made this like last year i think this is what the inside looks like it's just like a kitchen and then upstairs like bookshelf a desk area and a bed and then this sitting area so cute this is cc's house i have honestly never been in here there's bats in there it's actually like really nice she used dead leaves i don't know why but she did it needs to be finished i just don't feel qualified to finish it um let me know what you guys want me to put in here if you comment if you guys care like i can fix this up as a project for a video i didn't really mention but i built these like skylights i don't think you can get inside them i think in her video you could go inside them but i don't know why but it just bothered me <laughs> like i didn't want to go inside them because they were so ugly so that's the end of the stable where you can get out and these are the wash stations so i have more buckets a bucket to fill with water i don't know you can use it for whatever and then there's like these are actually full i just filled them for the video there's like shampoo, fly spray, all the things you need, a stool, that's what the washing stations look like. Like pretty similar to her video except like the obviously textures and some things are different. Okay, this is the outdoor arena. <laughs> Honestly, I just copied this but it was fun. It gave me something to do. Yeah, so this is the course. And then I, over here, I know you can probably see these crusty fences over here. This barn was on a server with a bunch of people and I think like it was Madison Dark Knight. She had a barn over here and like a Western arena. So if you guys want to see it, I was thinking about building hers and it was a lot of work. So if you guys want me to, I can do that for another video, but I haven't finished this plot yet. We can um, take a horse and enjoy some fun times. Let's do that. Mm, I'm gonna get Luna. Okay, let's take Luna and we'll saddle her up. So this is Luna being tacked up. 
Okay, let's go, Luna. All my other Minecraft videos I've filmed have been on my Nintendo Switch, honestly, which is gross, I know. Playing on a desktop is so much better. <laughs> Luna's a pretty good jumper, honestly. Oh my gosh, that was rough. I can take Luna and put Luna in a trailer, since I know that's what we all want to see. Actually, we'll do that last. And then I'll put a sign in Luna's stall that says, in trailer. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna put Luna in a trailer. Let's put her in the furthest one. I don't know why, just cause. Okay. Hey Luna, we'll be back. Okay guys, hopefully you enjoyed this tour of my rebuild of Grand Oak Stable. Let me know if you want me to do more things on this plot. I totally will. And also comment or add in the Google Forms what nostalgic horse Minecraft stables you'd like me to rebuild or ideas of what you want me to build originally. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Bye. I'm on the nice, you know I guess I've been hiding a monster Keeping it quiet, I don't want birds